So I have quite a few Luna caterpillars that are turning colors. They're more like a reddish color here. You can see them, quite a few of them. What I have learned is right before they make their cocoons, they turn this reddish color and I have there's a couple cocoons the easiest one to show you is way back here and that is a cocoon from one of the Luna moths and they he will stay in the cocoon for about three weeks before they hatch there's actually a big group of them back there I gotta move a little bit they look like they're all getting to be a red color I still have quite a few of them though that are eaten and I'll be checking on them every day to see how many are changing color and how many cocoons I have. I just got to be careful now when I change their food. I don't want to throw out any of their cocoons. Let's bring you back over here and show you this one one more time. Right in there. So I changed all their feed, the Luna Moths feed. And this side I have um, all the Luna Moth caterpillars that are still eating. And then on the other side here, let me go over to the other side. I have the ones, I have four, I found four cocoons so far. And then I do have some that are the red that I showed you earlier. So I just put some leaves on top of them to let them be able to make their cocoons. So we'll check back in a couple days and see if we have any more. There's a closer look up.